like you know when we get fat mm. we get these like soft like baby faces right yeah they don't get that as much they mm. just you know and then also like their arms might be skinnier right like i i know when i start getting a ton of weight my arms get real like not flabby but fat you know yeah like they balloon like like a like inflated balloon kind See, of. i don't have that i don't i don't ever get i don't think i ever get that problem really but i work maybe with, not i work with my hands you work with your arms you. yeah yeah you i'm not wrenching all day or like holding yeah. stuff all day you know not like that but um and I don't know if I don't know if that matters either, but I think it kind of does. Like I've met, um, I remember see, this everything. Is the, this is the thing about exercise that annoys me too. Is actually you bringing that up is that a lot of people will talk about how like you can't spot, you know, you you know, weight loss is just weight loss throughout your whole body, and I agree with that. But like, if you ever see someone that has a specific job they're going to have a specific build. Even though those people gain weight, they're gaining weight in very specific areas. Areas that they don't use as often. You know what I'm saying? And it's not always the case, but there's something to be said about that. And I no, I'm not a scientist. I'm not a doctor. No, I'm not. But I mean, if you just really pay attention to things, I think like you can formulate these, you know, cause, you know, doesn't necessarily mean it's causation. It just, but it's, but there's definitely a correlation. There's definitely something to be said about it. So, you know, I, and that's where like, do you remember, do you remember me at, like, uh, this is probably a couple of years ago we were on the phone and I was like, how much do you think, let me get my thoughts in order. Cause this, this is the issue with our fucking podcast is like, we have these like flow charts that like, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll be at the end of it and I'll go, Oh wait, shit. Let me back up. Yeah. Yeah. We were talking about like super scrawny dudes that like never stop moving. Like mm. even at break, they're like fucking bouncing or they're like doing something or like right. cleaning or something. And and then like they go home and they don't go like they don't like watch TV or they don't, you know, yeah. whatever. They're like, let me like pick weeds or let me like clean the garage or like I'm always they're always kind of moving. Do you remember yeah. like talking about that? Yeah, yeah. Like, dude, it's got to make a difference. No, it does. Yeah, like if you're sure. just fucking bouncing your leg, you're doing yeah. more than if you're not, you know, so yeah. like if you never relax, you never sit down and actually just like let your body do nothing. Mm -hmm. Like that's gotta be burning calories. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So a, a, the guy, the, the guy I've talked about a couple of times that I work with, um, the vegan guy who mm -hmm. like, whatever was, he's, he's like super into fitness and yeah. mobility and Wim Hof breathing and all this shit. Yeah. He, he brought up neat. There's actually like terminologies and the terminology of it. And like there's studies about this. Mm, it sounds so, familiar. I think so I know about non -exercise this. non-exercise activity thermogenesis. Yeah, 